All right, welcome to today's finds. We got quite a few, so let's get into it. First things first, we all know pink stones are my favorite, so finding a rose quartz was good enough to send me back home. I just put it in my pocket and then every time I felt like maybe it was time to stay longer, I could look at the pink stone and be like, yeah, I could go home. Yeah, I could go home. One find like that is good enough for the entire day. That little piece of rhyolite under it's super high quality. It's real funny. Don't neglect your smaller stones. Okay, of course we have a large thingamabobber here. This is a black tourmaline in the matrix. I like the pattern of it. It's like teeth. Some people will call black tourmaline shrill. It's kind of your friend. It points out to where other colors of tourmaline are. And it's a lot more common. Did we really find petrified wood? That's, that looks good. I don't know. What What's really tripping me out is I found this terminated kind of dog tooth calcite or I don't know what this is. I mean, look at that termination. It, it's a river rock, so it's broken. It's got these four sides. Probably point to that being a dog tooth calcite. High in granite. Carnelian. This was actually a crystal as well. I found this in the video and this is harder than calcite and it's a crystal. This is a crystal. I don't know what any of these crystals are. This is a crystal of sorts. It could be opalized wood. Um, what gives it away is this edge. This thing kind of came to a point. I thought it might look cool with these ones I found on other days. And this is what's weird is this one I found in the same area. Seems like that one. Seems the same as that. And this was found in the Mounties a little bit farther away. But it could be the same thing. And this probably not. This... Don't know what that is either. 